We are the Crane Couple, and we are in Kyoto, Japan. Yee. Guys, it's kind of a special day for us. Uh, we have been wanting to do this the past couple trips to Japan, but we didn't have time. Today, we are going to try on kimonos. Yeah. That's right, kimonos. You know, traditional Japanese clothing. Uh, we've set up an appointment. We've even got a little photo shoot thing set up. It's going to be awesome. Plus, we're going to go wander around afterwards because you can't just put it on for a no, little bit. No, you've got to go around. Plus, with all the effort, it seems like it takes to put one on. <laughs> yeah. It'd be a waste to take it off a couple hours after. So, come join us. Let's go. Well, me and Brittany just finished up our lovely photo shoot at the uh, Chaussee End Garden. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Brittany, you look stunning, my dear. Absolutely stunning. And uh, show you. oh, okay. I look okay, I guess. Nah, you look great. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, we got our uh, we did our photo shoot, it was amazing, incredible. Not too, but I figure if we're both gonna be all dressed up, get a nice uh, photo shoot done too. Yeah, it's kind of hard to get photos of us together. So yeah. I feel bad asking random people to take photos or videos of us. Yep. Picked up a little bit of a snack. Belgian waffle by Mannequin. Ta da! Mannequin chocolate Belgian waffle. Well, you don't have to get chocolate on this. No. They have a caramel to. one, I think they have a butter one, and like maybe. I'm assuming there's a maple one in there somewhere. I assume the chocolate one's the best one. Very Are nice. You good? Very nice indeed. Well, good choice, Brittany. It, it wasn't the longest photo shoot, but I mean, it's been like a couple hours and stuff. We had to get a quick breakfast before heading out for all this, and uh, well, why not? You look lovely today, Brittany. Well, out thanks. for a little walk. We're out walking at Fushimi Inari Taisha. Yeah. Yes. It's very famous, uh, the gates, the Tori gates. Yes. You've probably seen a million photos like this out and about, but uh, we're here to experience it for ourselves. We're going to share a little bit of it with you guys. In kimono. We are still wearing our kimono. Uh, it's going to be interesting in these sandals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's going to be very interesting. Not the most comfortable footwear. Nope. But Hey, you know, you, you got to dress the part when you're out here. Wow. So let's keep on moving. Let's go. We're at the entrance to Fushimi no Taisha's shrine. Uh, you got to uh, cleanse the hands. Do a little rinse right there. And you rinse your mouth. Release the water. You rinse your hand again. You dribble out all the water that you just picked up. Place it back on the rack. Easy. There you go. I was gonna tell you, like, you had a little drop there right there. Well done, Brittany. Thanks. We'll do the same here. Yep. Left hand. Can you purify the right hand? And then put a little bit on the left hand. Yes. Pour some water in your left hand. Rinse your mouth. Then you purify your left hand. Yeah. Then you rinse the ladle. There you go. I did good. Good job. It's still very dribbly, I'm sorry. You're good. <laughs> Purified. <laughs> so pure. The purest I've ever been. Yeah. Apparently, I, if I read correctly, it's dedicated to the god of like rice and grain, things like that. Oh. Something like that. It's I just a, know there's lots of foxes. <laughs> yes. And a lot of tori. Those yes. are these uh, gates that conveniently just happen to be right behind when I started talking hey. about that. Not scripted or anything. Well, there's a lot of them here. Uh, there are uh, a lot. Yes. Hundreds? Maybe thousands? I don't know how. Oh, um, maybe hundreds. There's going to be at least. There's going to be at least five. Hundred. Thousand. No, just five. There's at least five. There are a lot. That's for <laughs> yeah. sure. But uh, yeah, it's very, very popular. One of the most popular destinations here in Kyoto. You can see quite a few people coming by to give the blessings and all that. Uh, it's very nice. Hit 
the wrong button. Hold on, I'm recording you. How are you doing? I'm great, thanks. <laughs> Good photo shoot. Yeah. <laughs> we have finished up here at the, the very front of the grounds. Yeah. Are we ready to climb some steps? A little bit. Maybe just a little bit. <laughs> we don't have to go all the way to the top of the mountain. Yeah, but uh, right. Yeah, there's there's hundreds of these toti yeah. all around. They're very famous, absolutely beautiful. Yeah. We have to at least see how far we can go, right? Yes, but we do have these sandals on. Given the sandals, uh, <laughs> it might not be very far, but hey, we're going to try anyway. Yes. Gotta have big stairs for big shrines, Brittany. You can't. You have to. I have little legs. You can do it. And a kimono on. You got it, don't worry. All right. Yakum Yako Mamori. A realization of your earnest wishes. Oh. Yeah. Well, maybe we need one, Brittany. Always keep it in your bag, wallet, purse, or pocket. They got little foxes on there too. Yeah. They even have purple string. I yeah. think you should get one. I'm thinking about it. They just got one. I know. You should get one too. Kintai Mamori. It brings you healthy as strong as gold. Well, I mean, it does look like nice gold right there. Yeah, it's cute. Very cute. Oh. Kind of thinking about it, huh? They got a lot of charms to sell here at Shiminari yeah. Taisha. But the, the further you go up, the better it looks. They have more, uh, more wooden plaques to write your wishes and all that on. Except these are foxes. Foxes, Brittany. Yeah, they're so cute. Very cute. Yeah, they just come up a little higher and find even better stuff. But it's nice because you can actually draw a little face on them. Look at this. Look at these guys. So cute. Here's a little map. Not really little, but a map indeed of Mount Inari. Uh, yeah. That's a long way up, Brittany. Do you think you can do it? <laughs> no. We can go higher though, for sure. We've barely seen anything. All the way over here. Yeah. We just, did, bit, we just did this. The double gates. And now go and all the way through. <laughs> this says right here that this section right here is only a thousand. I can see that. So see, you were telling me hundreds. And I now, didn't know there were so many. We already blew past that number right here in the yeah. beginning. That's that's really cool. Well, we are actually at the gate to the mountain. Are you ready to climb, Brittany? Let's do this. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Poor feet, but let's go. the fun part the stairs good luck I'm so scared he just wants to cross I just want to cross oh baby me. he's gonna wait for his opening <laughs> he just ran away aww so climbing the mountain we're so early on yep got lots and lots of gates to look at it's very pretty Lots of nice scenery right here, but yeah. it's pretty awesome. I feel so different just being right here. Nice and calm and quiet. Peaceful. So, so quiet. <laughs> Way quieter than Tokyo. <laughs> Viewing area like 10 quiet. minutes away. We're only oh, like oh, maybe yeah, halfway yeah. up the mountain. So, so we got a long way to go. I think there's but, uh, no it's only 25 to minutes to the okay. top, supposedly. Mm. Maybe closer to 30 in our kimono and uh, sandals. <laughs> but hey, so let's do this. Me. I think we can do this. I think we can do it. I will say, the burning in my legs has taken the pain away from my feet. <laughs> Is that so bad? I don't feel anything in my feet anymore. <laughs> my feet are just like chunks <laughs> of flesh getting dragged around by my burning hot calves. Let's keep going. Okay. So I got a ways. Oh, 
we climbed up some big steps and we found a very nice view. Mm -hmm. Nice cityscape of Kyoto out here. Gorgeous. It's so cool. It's awesome. Nice it's, time of day to be out here too. It's crazy seeing all the buildings and then like all the trees in front of it. <laughs> yeah, there's still a lot of natural environment to enjoy around this area. It's a long way up, Brittany. My knees are burning. <laughs> the pain is like rolling upwards through your body. It's not easy to get up here in a kimono, I'll tell you. I saw a dude. You see how steep this is? Yeah. They're not having an easy time either. We made it to the top. Just a few more steps. Proud of you, Brittany. You did great. I'm tired. It was a tough climb for sure, especially uh, in these uh, sandals. Sandals and restricted movement from kimono, but we climbed the mountain. Very restricted. Very restricted. <laughs> but we did it, we did great. And now to go back down. It'll be easier going back down. Maybe. Hopefully. Probably. <laughs> Brittany, the return trip is even better. These guys, oh. Oh, you guys are so cute, so oh. hungry. There's even cats so under the cute. table. They're everywhere. Look at this guy, Brittany. He's so cute. Oh, what? What? Someone say food. Okay. Okay. And away he goes. He's gonna go climb the mountain too. Yeah. Eat his mustache. <laughs> <laughs> Same. <laughs> Aww. Everyone loves the kitty. <laughs> Best part. Yes. Worth the trip. Yep. Keep this little sleepy kitty. Where are you going? Come back. Kitty. Bye. Well, that's it for our visit to Shimi Inari Taisha. It's a uh, crowded here. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of people but it's very popular for a reason. It is beautiful even though it can be kind of an exhausting trek up there even uh, in regular clothes but never mind what we're wearing right now. But it was a lot of fun. It was Hopefully, worth it. Yeah. Maybe you get a chance to check it out if you're ever in Japan. Make your way over to Kyoto. One of the best things to do out here for yes. sure. Thank you guys for watching. We are The Cream Couple. Don't forget to like and comment. Let, it, let us know what you think about our little Kimono Day video right here hey. in Kyoto, Japan. It was a lot of fun. Uh, these are beautiful. There's a lot of shops that uh, rent kimonos all over Kyoto. But uh, this place is pretty nice. Uh, maybe not the cheapest prices, but definitely really good service for sure. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. We've got lots of other great videos coming for you guys, including from this Japan trip. There's a lot of stuff here. And if you haven't already, go ahead and turn on that bell. That way you get notifications whenever we post new videos. And again, there's a lot coming soon, so you don't want to miss any of it. Finally, once again, a huge thanks to everyone who helped make Japan Trip Part 3 a reality. You guys are incredibly generous, and we really hope that you enjoy everything else that we've got in store for you from this trip, okay? Yeah. Anyway, see you next time. Bye.